Hello again everybody, this is Scott Hudgens with Dodd RV, located in Yorktown, Virginia. Today we're looking at a brand new 2020 Forest River FR3 32DS. Class A gas motorhome on a Ford chassis, two slide outs with bunk beds, great floor plan, under 35 feet. Let's take a look. All right, starting on the outside, you see the nice FR3 Forest River windshield, nice logo, easy access front to the hood, LED lights, side cameras right in the blind spot, the Ford V10 gas engine, 19 and a half inch wheels, down low storage, you see the propane, Nice small storage bin, thick slam latch compartments. Fifty five hundred Onan gas generator. More storage compartments that go all the way through. Nice roto cast with drain holes. Your sewage compartment, black tank flush, city water hookup outside shower. You do have a light pull valve, dumps right below. Another storage area, gas fill. And then this is going to be your large storage area. So a lot of space here. Again, nice bin, but it does go all the way through. And there's where you store the ladder for that front bunk area. Rear ladder for roof access. Backup camera. 5,000 pound tow hitch. We do have Running toppers over your slide outs. Opened up a couple of these compartments, the other side of your pass through. You do have a LP quick connect for gas line. Another storage bin there. Your low point drain, so twist those off to get to the water low point drains. Nice storage again throughout you do have you do have electrical connections there outside entertainment is a tv outside speakers your last compartment is your batteries and your hydraulics for your leveling Large assist handle. You are prepped for solar, so trickle charge those batteries with the portable solar panel. Three entry step, so nice and low to the ground, easy to get in. All right, so entering into the 32DS. You'll see the one slot out in the living area. Sofa and dinette across from each other. TV located over the dinette. Good spot in front of the sofa. Side hallway. And then your front cab area. Good place to start there, the cab. Ford chassis, you do have auto leveling, you'll see that front shade is electric, and it definitely opens up the light for this area, but it definitely blackens it out. Your side shades 
our manual. Both chairs do rotate. So they will be in the living area. And you do have a removable table, which is here with cup holders, which sits in the floor. Your monitor for your backup and side cameras. Extension there, good for maps. Laptop. Your overhead bunk. One thing nice that the FR3 does, I'll step down here and hit the switch, which is down low here at the entry door. You have a key. So turning that on. Lowering that bunk. Again, we're just running off the battery right now. So what does that take about 15 seconds? So large bunk over the cab. They've got their own lights, their own cubby holes for storage. You do have a ladder that mounts right there on the front. What is unique about this floor plan, look how much space it is from the bunk to the driver's seat. So I can literally drive with the bunk down. I've got enough headroom. So a lot of the other brands, when you put this bunk down, it either rests on this seat or you have to lower the seat or lean the seat back to have room. You still have plenty of room, great headroom around the bunk. This is an electric bed. It rests on a frame. Way better weight limit than those manual single bunks. One adult could sleep up there pretty comfortably. Two kids, no problem. So nice setup there, but made for people to use. And that's how people use them. They put some kids up there, they want them to be able to sleep comfortably, not worry about it coming down. Store some gear up there while you're driving. You know, you have that option. Your booth dinette. So a large booth dinette makes into a bed. And then you do have storage underneath. Sofa. The sofa does have footrests, seat belts, that easy just setting the bed down on the sofa so basically a jackknife sofa and then lifting from the back and push it in set back up into the sofa position blackout roller shades throughout good overhead storage Nice deep countertops, extra countertop extension here. Deep drawers. Nice down low drawers. 
Good spot for trash can. You also have two stainless steel sinks. Spray head, locks right back in. Countertop extension, large four door gas electric refrigerator freezer. Nice pantry space. Normally when you get the bigger fridge, you lose the pantry, but you still get it in this. Large microwave oven. Still get the oven. Three burner range with the flush cover. Going down the hallway, you see the bunk area. Again, you have a sofa that drops down to make into a bed. With seat belts, you got a bunk over top, which is in the up position now, which drops down with lights. Locks right up out of the way. Cup holders. And it is directly across from the TV, so the kids can play games, watch movies going down the road. Solid door, so at night, kids are sleeping, you're sleeping. Solid door to close off that area. Your bathroom is located here, directly across. Nice room around the toilet with the foot flush. Good storage area. Nice little small sink. Receptacle. More storage area. This is basically your vanity. And then you get the glass enclosed shower. Good room in the shower. Nice tall skylight. Again. I am 6'5". I've got, I'm not in the dome, but I'm just above the top edge of the shower. Eye level. Shower head's still going to go down on me. So plenty of room there. Your convenience area. Control your slides, generator. Your holding tanks, all from one spot. King size walk around bed. Receptacles, USB plugs, all the way around. Again, blackout shade. Tons of hanging space. On either side, very deep drawers. Again, another charging area. TV, hidden storage behind it. You also are equipped with two ducted ACs. We are looking at 50 amp service. Again, two slide outs, plenty of space. I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching the video. I really appreciate it. And if you have not yet already subscribed, please do so down below. I put in new motorhomes, travel trailers, fifth wheels on daily. So if you have any questions or comments, please post those down below as well. And if you're looking for a particular floor plan that you have not yet seen, uh, I'll do my best to put that on for you as well. We have been family owned and operated here at Dodd RV since 1956. So we'd love to earn your business. Thanks again for watching. Scott Hudgens, Dodd RV.